Understanding In-Game Purchases, a Guide for English Learners. Hello, everyone. Today, we're going to explore a popular term in the world of video games, in-game purchases. This phrase is not only relevant for gamers but also for anyone interested in digital culture. Let's dive into what this term means and why it's important. In-game purchases refer to the buying of goods or services within a video game. These purchases are made using real-world money, but what you buy is used within the game itself. They can include various items, such as cosmetic enhancements, like outfits for characters, new levels or features, or even in-game currency. This concept is a key part of many modern video games. Games offer these purchases for several reasons. Firstly, they provide an additional revenue stream for game developers, above and beyond the initial sale of the game. Secondly, in-game purchases can enhance the gaming experience for players, offering new challenges or ways to enjoy the game. However, they can also be controversial, sometimes leading to discussions about fairness and game balance. Let's look at some examples. In a game like Fortnite, players can buy outfits or skins for their characters. In mobile games like Candy Crush, you can purchase extra lives or special abilities. These purchases often enhance enjoyment but are not necessary to complete the game. In-game purchases have significantly impacted both the gaming industry and gamers. They have led to the development of free-to-play models, where the game is free but enhanced through purchases. They also raise questions about spending habits and digital consumerism among players, especially younger audiences. I hope this video has helped clarify what in-game purchases are and why they're an integral part of today's gaming world. Whether you're a gamer or just interested in digital trends, understanding this concept is key. Happy gaming, and see you in the next video.